The other thing I didn't like in school was when they tried to teach about sex and drugs and stuff like that. Because they don't really teach you about them as much as they just try and scare you into never wanting to do either of them ever. Right? Like when I was a kid, we had this thing called the, the D.A.R.E. program. That's where they have police officers come to your school to teach you about drugs. Very scary way to learn about it. The way it works is a cop comes to the front of the class. You know, he's got a mustache, right? <laughs> Some people will tell you that marijuana, also known in the streets as pot, weed, herb, Buddha, ganja, chronic, sensi, mila, the sticky, icky, icky, trees, lime, Mary Jane, sweet, Lucy, dinky, dow, bombalacha, and in the browner parts of town, la planta verde del diablo. <laughs> is not dangerous. What I'm here to tell you, if you ever come into contact with even second-hand marijuana smoke, you're gonna start hallucinating and think it can fly, you're gonna jump out a window. If you smoked it outside, well, you're just gonna run inside, find a window, and then jump out of it. Then you're gonna be in all this pain. How you deal with the pain? Have to start smoking crack. And how you gonna afford to buy all this crack? I'm gonna tell you how you're sticking penises in your mouth in exchange for money. So in conclusion, don't do drugs, I'll be penises in your mouth. I'll go to recess. Thank you. Sex ed, you know, basically same shit. Health teacher comes to the front of the class. She's got a mustache. Some people will tell you that vaginas, also known in the streets as beaver, coochie, na na, cha cha, snatch, twat, the sticky, icky, icky, bearded clam, panty, hamster, rooster, jaws, ninja, boot, crotch, waffle, wizard, sleeve, and in the browner parts of town, the notorious VAG <laughs> is not dangerous. Want me to tell you, if you ever come into contact with even second hand vagina juice, you're gonna impregnate every woman in a five mile radius with quintuplet AIDS babies. And how do you plan on supporting all these teens to weens to AIDS and babies? I'ma tell you how if you're sticking penises in and around your mouth in exchange for money. So in conclusion, don't have sex, I'll be penises in your mouth. Let's go to the cafeteria and eat some chalupas. Thank you.